All right, episode one. We should have our technical difficulties sorted. So, Murphy Courier 6 wakes up at the Mojave Outpost and immediately heads out on his grand adventure. It's like the interior Repcon or something. All right, let's check it out. All right. Um, hmm. Oh, okay. Hey, I get it. I was like, hey, that's floating in midair. But no, it's not. It's actually part of this gate here. Um, let's see here. First things first. Let's see if we can get some of that. Barrel cactuses. Awesome. We have their stats. All right. We're gonna hide the bodies. Blah blah blah. blah. Okay. Items. We have a nine millimeter pistol. Looks like we have fifty-two rounds for it. We have a prospector outfit. We have three stem packs, three barrel cactuses at lunch, uh, five waters, twenty-six cases of Sierra Madre chips, which I don't even know where the hell we got that from. Yeah. All right. So first things first. Let's. I saw this gentleman over here. I'm not sure you should be here. Hey. Hey. Who are you? How have you not seen me around here before? I I live here. How do you like being stationed here? I I wish that I had somebody that was even remotely similar <laughs> to me that I could talk to. Why do you hate this place so much? This dust out here is literally the worst. It's moon dust, and if it rains at all, it just sticks to your boots like Yeti shit. <laughs> it could be worse if we camp Forlorn Hope. At least there's actually stuff to do there. And the people at Forlorn, Forlorn Hope are somewhat competent and don't break their rifles by slamming them in the door to the building. Fair. All right, hold on. Oh. All right. Where are those statues out front? Big statues. They're real stupid. You can't climb to the top of them. Don't jump off. It really hurts. You're not a regular soldier, are you? What tipped you off? The fact that I'm competent? <laughs> I imagine patrol of this place must make you wish for a nuclear winter. Yeah, 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 I know. It makes you wish for a nuclear winner. Makes you win for a nuclear win. Shut up! <laughs> Why aren't you patrolling the outpost? I'm assigned to work in the armory, and I've finished everything for today. Why are the civilians in this military outpost? I don't know. It's I guess there's like a bunch of ants down there. <laughs> so Ranger Jackson won't let anyone through. Do you have any advice for me? You gotta act like you're mediocre. Because otherwise they ask you to do extra things. Goodbye. That's super. All right, well, I'll see you later. I'm going to go try and fix Cool. All right. And that is Zank from uh, Mike Burnfire Companions. Got business here. I do. Uh... Excuse me? What do you want, civvy? What's a civvy? That's you. You're a civvy. A civilian who sadly doesn't know the joy of proudly serving in the NCR. All right. Should go. Uh-huh. All right. Cool. Um, so the notes we have said... Okay, so I go to Prim for that, or... Hold on, hold on. It's a little further out. No, not untenable. But we also can go this way, get him, talk to the administrator, then go over here and do this one. That sounds like the plan anyway. But let's run around here real quick and... Hey, don't sneak up on a guy like that, asshole. Why so jumpy? Why so many questions? What do you want? 
Why? Yeah, 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 whatever. Where's your cover at, soldier? There. Caravan, citizen, pilgrim, or... Uh, toilet salesman. What? Just need something for the logbook. Keeping tabs on traffic throughout the outpost. Although mostly just in. If you're looking for the commanding officer, he's in the back. Although, he's got a lot on his plate, so if you speak with him, keep it short. Also, if you need any gear checked, we can get you up and running again. Once you fill out the work orders and... Okay, we'll come right back to him. There's another thing I really need to fix real quick. Alright, and... <clears throat> back after fixing a thing. Yeah, nine lives left. Blah, blah, blah. Okay, so... A specialist Zank told us about the ants, so we need to talk to Ranger Jackson. When I got this assignment, I was hoping there'd be more gambling. Well, you're not Ranger Jackson. Um. And close the door. It's been a long tour. All I can think about now is going back home. Okay, cool. Um. Hey. Hello. Hello. Well, looks like we got a new visitor in the old Brahmin pen. Mm hmm. Not many people coming here in a hurry, only passing through. Yep. And if you're passing through, you picked a bad time. Road north has gone to hell, and if I let a caravan through, they won't make it. Okay. It should seem like you have enough soldiers. Soldiers, no. Recruits, yes. And the Mojave outpost has been ordered to have a standing force at the NCR perimeter at all times. So sending anyone out reduces the outpost's numbers, and would be in direct violation of my orders. You sound frustrated. Frustrated? No, I have my orders. Sign and approved all the way up the chain from Kimball. And I understand the reasons. The outpost isn't a legion target, yet. Not like Vegas or the Dam. But if the caravans get choked here, that's gonna bite NCR hard. Yeah. Anyway, didn't mean to talk your ear off. Some days, just feel like more requisition forms and daily reports... Help. No, look, I appreciate... Uh, you know what? Yes, I could use the help. And you look like you can handle yourself. Okay. I need to get the caravans moving again. That means clearing a path north. There's too much crawling the asphalt up the road to allow it. Sounds like a deal. Thanks. I appreciate it. Come back here when you're done. I might accidentally lose some supplies to pay you with. Cool. Hello. 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 All right. Hello. No, hold up, I wanted to check something. Um, ah, early bird. Plus one to each of your specials from 6 a.m. to 12 p.m. It's probably, it's at right after 12, so no, we ain't got a bonus. Okay, they said something about... Okay, let's go. Burn this crap hole to the ground. Excuse me? Favorite. What? What do you want? Mm, sorry. Sorry. I'm not in a good mood right now. Um, what's wrong? Some of my <coughs> playing cards were stolen. Some really important ones. It's going to be difficult to win a game of Caravan without them. People actually play Caravan? We have to do something around here to pass the time, and we're limited on options. We throw rocks at tin cans, complain about the weather, and play caravan. Want to play other card games like poker, go fish, or euchre? I've never even heard of that last one. Pretty sure you made it up. Look, we can't play proper card games because nobody around here has a full deck. Do you have any idea how hard it is to get all 52 cards out here? And even when we do get a complete set, it doesn't last long, as people inevitably steal the best cards for their caravan. 
Maybe just misplaced them? No, only the important cards are missing. I still have all my crappy number cards, but you better believe I'm short a few kings. I'll keep an eye out for them. Thanks, but they didn't have any distinguishing markings, so you wouldn't be able to tell them from any other playing card. I'll just have to buy some replacements from the traveling merchants. See you around. Hmm. Alright, so what was this quest we just got? Ask around about the stolen playing cards. Hmm. Well, this was one weird jumpy guy over here. I'm not sure you should be here. Nothing about cards? Okay, that cards? One. You lost? Chew. What, what? I'm busy here. Looking for some missing playing cards. And you're accusing me of stealing them. Is that it? Well, you're acting suspicious. No, you seem like an honest person. Damn right. I'm super honest. I rarely ever get court-martialed. You should feel ashamed of yourself for stealing. I didn't steal shit, and you can't prove it. Besides, there's just one thief in the NCR, and everybody else is just trying to get their shit back. How much those stolen cards worth to you? That depends. How much you got? Aha! So you did steal them. No, I didn't. You you said I... <laughs> shit. Look, I only took the sixes and, and a few kings. That's all. With these cards, I'll be unstoppable. What do you mean? Look, you can put whatever card you want in your caravan deck. So I'm loading mine down with sixes and tens. It's an unbeatable strategy. How so? The goal of the game is to make stacks of cards whose value is between 21 and 26. So I build each of my stacks with a 10, a 6, and a king. A king? Kings can double any number card. Double the 6 and pair it with a 10. Double the 10 and pair it with a 6. Either way, it completes the stack. All right. So, add kings to your own cards, and add jacks to the opponents. Jacks are good too? Yeah, asshole. A jack removes one of your opponent's cards. The game isn't just about building your own caravans, it's about sabotaging others. What about queens? Queens are fucking garbage. Absolutely useless. Never use them. I'm telling you, load your deck with those four cards. Tens, sixes, kings, and jacks. It works 100% of the time, every. Get back the stolen cards or I'll tell everybody your strategy. All right, all right. Take them. Just keep this between you and me, okay? Uh huh. Now I know about caravan. Hey. This barrel is a tripping hazard. Get out of here, barrel. Hey, PFC Gray, I'm about to make your day. What? You're just stolen cards. Oh, nice work. You even got me back to King who's stabbing himself. He's my favorite. Here's some caps for your trouble. And you can keep it this card from me. It's the Ace of Spades, because friend, your race is in my book. It's a terrible pun. Um, did you give me monies? Thirty-seven. So he must have given me some caps. Okay. So now we you know about caravan. We're gonna clean, do a little cleaning up here. Trying to figure out what to get Marjorie for Christmas. Unfortunately, psychiatric help is not an option. Well, that depends on how far you're willing to go. I'm sure there's a cam that'll fix her up just as good as any shrink. Are you suggesting I get my daughter, my pride and joy, hooked on drugs? I'd say if there was a line, you just crossed it. Michael, the day we met, I hit on your wife, killed your Brahmin, and got you so drunk you nearly shot your little girl while she was still in your balls. If you had a line, we wouldn't be friends. Hey. Did you hear what happened to Linda? Yeah. She was a tough son of a bitch, too. But super mutants are on another level. Uh, give me a second. I won't look. Don't I know it. I armed the rest of the mutant once. It was like trying to bench press a truck. 
If that isn't a load of horse shit, I'm gonna have to ask why there's so many flies around your mouth. <coughs> Says the guy who told me he once kept a Yao Lai as a pet. Face it, you lie so much you're basically a rug. Ha, <laughs> fair enough, asshole. So who won this fictional arm wrestling match of yours? Why do you even have to ask? Well, I've seen your arms, so no, I guess I don't. What I can't figure out is how they're still attached to your body. Right. Hey there. All right. Buffalo Gord? Yeah. All right. I was going to do my usual quick little cleanup in here, but she doesn't buy miscellaneous items. Who's this man with the hat? I really have more important things to do. Sorry. You suck. When I got this assignment, I was hoping it'd be more Hi. gambling. Hey there. Hey. Howdy. All right. Action for men. Looking for trouble? Uh. Got no time or answers for you. Ask a drifter in need of a few caps. They'll... All right. Drinking to forget, and it's only getting me mad instead. Whiskey always gets my temper up now more than ever. Drinking used to cause all sorts of trouble back west. Before I punched enough people, that is. And they learned to lay low when the whiskey hit. Uh, how about you keep your hands to sides? Don't worry. Not looking to throw punches just yet. And something tells me hitting you would be a mistake I wouldn't want to repeat. Lost my caravan heading north. The driver burned to ash. And they didn't even take the... Why'd they do that? My guess is Legion. They're trying to cut NCR's supply line. And the Mojave outpost is proof. Got us locked up tighter than a new Vegas virgin. No caravans in, out, and just try arguing with Jackson about it. Roads aren't safe, he said. No shit, you washed out old fuck up. I didn't need a brotherhood. Yeah, he's been with NCR so long, all he can see is the worst outcome of everything. Jackson won't let me head north. It's not safe. And even though my caravan's gone, my caravan papers are keeping me here. So if you came here for work, my advice? Go find the Crimson Caravan branch south of Vegas. They can help you. Okay. All right. You t New face in the outpost. You work around here? Work around here? Might check with Jackson in the main building, or ghost up on the roof above, but watch out. She's, well, she's kind of a bitch. Don't tell her I said that, though. Might take a bullet some night when I'm going to the latrine. Not too much. A lot of caravans going nowhere. A lot of troopers going nowhere, too. A few prospectors here and there, but they don't do more than stink up the Everybody's backed up here. You'd think it'd be good for business, but most of the traders are tight with the caps. Even the larger car. What, caravan? All right. I'll give it a go. Ha Zynga. No, I hate that show. <laughs> Background? Just... Okay, yeah, she's done. <laughs> she's done with Take... the, me having caravan. Taking all of her money with caravan. Hold up. Ah, uh, she doesn't buy miscellaneous items. Hold up. Here we go. Um, there we go. That was my miscellaneous stuff. Um, what do you do? You have nine mil? Do you have a rifle? That would be cool. She has a grenade rifle. I don't have explosives. Uh, she has a service rifle. Yeah, but I'm gonna get one off Jackson anyway. Um, she does have nine mil rounds. Yeah, there's my explosive skill that I need. Alright, let's see here. Tea biscuits. <laughs> Alright. Alright, how we going now? 345. Okay, uh, we can talk to Ghost real quick. Heard your footsteps coming up the ramp. Didn't sound like a trooper or one of the merchants. You a courier? If so, 
This might be your lucky day. If you don't mind walking a bit. And your eyes... I think there's trouble in Nifton. No traffic from there on the roads. And while I can explain that away, the smoke from the town, I can't. All right. I'm sure it's been hit. What I need to know is if they survived it. Might be powder gangers with all that smoke in the... If there's anybody left, they'd be in the Nipton Town Hall. Go there. Check it out. I'll do it. All right. Listen, I don't want you getting killed for this. So if you... Not much to tell. One of the worst posts in the NCR if you're looking to be anything more than a babysitter. Full up here, but just enough so we can't send out patrols. Gotta maintain a standing force. Can't spare men for patrols or escorts, so caravans are backing up here like a Brahmin with a bottle in its ass. Kimball's Kimball. Not sure which end is his ass or his head. Caravan families are causing trouble. Big circle getting tense. Look, you want gossip? Go to the bar downstairs and listen to a whole lot of nothing. Me? I gotta keep watch, then fill out the daily log. Alright. Mind yourself on the plank going down. Okay. And... That will bring us to the end of episode one. So we've checked out the outpost. Uh, we've got a few things we can do before it gets dark. He is about to take off on a grand adventure. Um, go take care of some ants for uh, Ranger Jackson. What else we got stacking up here? Let's see. Uh, recon on the now. Can you find it in your heart? Clear out the... Oh, that one's going to be a ways to get to. Like, we can kill the ants, and then run back up here and crash out for the evening. I meant to see if she had a dang bedroll and campfire. Hmm. Hmm. Because she had a bedroll and campfire. Then I could kill the ants, move on down till it got dark. Maybe make. Yeah, let's, let's go see if she has that. You literally don't have any miscellaneous items either. She's like literally just guns and caps and stuff. All right, well, let's go see if we can take care of this for our debuff hits. Patrolling the Mojave almost makes yeah, sure. yeah. So they said the thing. Oh, oh, oh. Whoa. Where are you hauling ass from? Also, I gotta do my tourist thing and get up on that billboard there. Take a, a shotty shot. All right. Aim. Wait for it. There it is. 
is. Aim shots, not wasting ammo. Hit the barrier wall. Okay, well, ragdolls. Whoa, where <laughs> he got launched to the moon? Goodbye. I don't have the hunter perk. Another one that got launched into Arizona. He's a part of the moon program. <laughs> Alright. Yeah, we gotta get back up and catch a rest, because... Um Not fucking want. Shit. Look up the book of water. They're very cool. this dude. Alright. Yeah, I almost messed up. Did I? Am I poisoned? Yeah. I need to... Go catch a snooze. Hey, buddy. Hey there. Need any? Let's 
see. Maybe some roasted maize, cool. Alright, it's not the most ideal. We'll use one. A couple will go buffalo gourd seeds, maize, have a water. I'm going to have to fix that. <clears throat> Hold on. Give me just a second. I'll be right back. All right. And back after fixing a few things. Constantly tweaking. <laughs> 225 mods. Uh, let's see. I saw Ranger Jackson got paid. Um... Patrolling the Mojave almost makes you wish for Yeah, yeah, that's the thing. Yeah, yeah. You guys keep saying that. Background? Just right, going now. <laughs> Patrolling the Mojave. Jesus. Okay, that's like five on the count, man. All right. First things first. Let's eat. Let's drink. All right. Started off with a Coke, so we haven't got, got any coffee yet. Alright, he's loaded up. We'll do 556 five, is first. There we go. <clears throat> We won't go quietly. The Legion can count on that. Now. Get down here and look at our options. Hmm. Alright. Looking that way, we can go to Prim, Good Springs, get that done. Or we can swing over to go to Nipton, get that knocked out. I'm thinking we could race across there, get to Good Springs, get our stuff done, come back, get our bike, get Nipton, maybe get back here to, by the end of the day. All right, get down off. Well, actually, let's uh, <coughs> let's pause right there, and we'll be back momentarily. Um, okay, 13 minutes. All right. Actually, we'll make it we'll make this one about a 20 25 one. All right. So, let's haul butt to Good Springs, figure it out from there. Ouch. Hello there. Jesus. I'll tell it started off in you did there's an old wasteland legend that says somewhere out there is a fabulous treasure from before the those caps with the blue star on them the tail goes are the key to that treasure all over the place the easiest place to find them is unopened bottles of sunset sarsaparilla you'd think they'd all have been picked clean by now but somehow new bottles keep appearing in the machine some say it's old festus that does it Hoping someone will finally collect enough caps to earn the treasure. Other than bottles, you'll just have to scavenge. You can find caps in the unlikeliest of places, and blue star caps are no exception. It's said that the treasure is guarded by a man named Festus, and he's the one who asked for the blue star caps. It's also said he's been around since the war, standing a lonely vigil, waiting for someone to come and take the treasure off his hand. That'll make him pretty damn old. But I've met a few people in my travels who claim they actually met him, and they weren't the... Nah, I gave it up years ago. Too dangerous. And even if I did still collect them, I'd tell you the same. There's people out there so mad with the idea of treasure, 
that they'll attack strangers just on the suspicion that they have. No one knows. Money, weapons, water. It is, or maybe was, something of value. And that's enough to get people motivated. Thanks for the info. I'll be going now. No problem. If you do end up trying to collect more stars, watch out for a man named Alan Marks. He's killed several people for their stars. Alright, Malcolm Holmes, after you just scared the living crap out of me. And we're jogging. Bonus. Let's see here. See, everything is plus one because of early bird. So. I'm trying to not have to fight shit. <laughs> I'm trying to just run my ass across here. And get her done. I'm probably being followed by God knows how many scorpions. Let's not run up on them. Shit. Fuck. Well, I got taken out. <laughs> and there's my first dead live. Alright, we'll be back momentarily. <laughs> 